We're here with um, the new Pacific Swimming Coach, Peter Richardson Coach. Congratulations on uh, the job. Talk about what it's been like coming back to uh, your alma mater. Uh, it's incredible, absolutely incredible. I, you know, I was, for the last 10 years, people have told me, you know, Pete, you really bleed orange and black, and that's truly how I feel about this program. Coming back to my alma mater is a special place. Uh, I'm passionate about the Stockton community, about UOP, and I really couldn't be happier. There's not a, not a better job in the world, not a better opportunity in the world than being right here at Pacific. And, uh, Coach, you guys are kind of in your off-season right now, but I know you guys are still working pretty hard. Talk about um, maybe co what you've been instilling in the first couple weeks yeah. now. Well, I think the first, the first step, as soon as I got here, I think day one, I, I think understanding that University of the Pacific Swimming is a championship program, going back to, to Coach Bill Rose in the 70s, to Brad Schumacher in the early 90s and winning um, Olympic gold medals, and then you know Ray Lou's uh, kind of the era I swam in uh, in the early 2000s. Understanding who we are is a championship program, that was our first step. Uh, before we could kind of think of the future and what we can do, that's the base, is, is understanding who we are. This is a championship program. And so that's step one. Step two is, well, immediately we've uh, been on the phones and all the recruiting stuff. That's, that's, that's a given. But we've got a few athletes here that are looking forward to making uh, the Olympic trials. And so time's running short on that opportunity. It's, it's at the end of June. So we've got athletes in the water now. And, and they're swimming with the, the local swim club as, as well as me being on deck uh, during the offseason as well. Getting things going, trying to make trials, and we've got a few club meets coming up in the next few weeks. So uh, jumping right in. Uh, and Coach, I know you mentioned that uh, the program has had a lot of success in the past. Talk about you know, what makes you think it can uh, get back to that level. Well, uh, I mean, look around. Uh, anybody who steps foot at the University of the Pacific just sees how gorgeous of a, of a, of a place this is. Uh, and anyone who, who's involved in the classes knows just the closeness of the faculty, closeness of the campus, and, you know, education, uh, edu educating the whole person, uh, not just one side of, of uh, an individual. And so it's a special place. Now, with that in mind, our goals uh, to compete for a championship every year, compete for a championship every single year. And, and we've got some work to do, and, and the recruiting is a big part of that, but we have some pieces of the puzzle here that are really, really talented. And I'm looking forward to seeing not just the bringing in the next recruiting class, uh, which is obviously of, of, of major importance, but developing who we have here. And we have a lot of pieces of the puzzle here. So what makes me think that we can win here? Because, uh, you know, we won two conference championships and uh, finished in the top 15 in the nation when I was here as a student athlete. And so I saw the formula. I know it works. And I think if you believe in something greater than yourself, it's not just following the black line. Swimming is a pretty daunting sport if it's just about following the black line. But when it comes to believing in something greater than yourself, then you, can, uh, you won't surprise yourself with the things you can accomplish.